hello everyone in this session we're going to learn how to be print a diamond to begin with we're going to work how do we print half the diamond lower half then we will try to see how do we do the upper half then we'll try to complete the full one right so now let's start to print the lower portion of the hollow diamond now if the input is four i want an output like this four lines right and uh, for better understanding okay uh, i'm just considering this because the only difference between this and this out here is i have replaced the space character with a hyphen so that we can understand things in a much better way right now what i like to observe is i would like to observe the number of characters to be printed in each line so my input if it is 4 how many characters are present in each line right let's observe here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 so okay the number of characters to be printed in each line is 8 either it might be first line or second line third line or fourth line okay if the input is 5 like you want to print 5 lines how many characters do we need to print totally 10 okay 10 characters in each line so from this what we understood is the number of characters to be printed in each line is 2 into n all right now let us try to observe how many stars we need to print right and then how many spaces we need to print and remember in between okay the stars there are some stars to be printed on the left side followed by some spaces followed by some stars at the right so let us try to observe this there are two stars but we're going to start with one star then how many spaces here six spaces and again okay we have some stars how many one here now here we have two stars followed by again how many spaces four and then number of stars here it is two right again three stars then two spaces then again three stars right then four stars zero and then four stars totally eight stars is this clear but if you just add up everything okay one plus six plus one is eight then two plus four plus two is also eight three plus two plus okay three is also eight now the same way if you try it out here okay one star and number of spaces out here is eight and followed by again one and then two stars right okay and two stars here okay the remaining one will be spaces six right okay three stars then four then here it is again three clear okay so from this we basically understood the pattern okay of number of spaces to be printed and number of stars to be printed okay now let's jump in and try to write the code for Okay, I'm going to start with this wherein okay a basic template which has the display function and the reading of the input right after reading of the input I need to print how many lines n number of lines so okay, I'll be using a for loop right how many stars do I need to print two but one star followed by spaces followed by a star right e now I'd like to say I'd like to print a star right and followed by some spaces and followed by a star again okay clear so we need to print star followed by space and followed by star okay now i want to control this through a variable so first time i'd like to start with one when i start with one you can just observe that i can just use i out here okay so the first iteration one star followed by some spaces followed by one star and when i value is two then there'll be two stars followed by some spaces followed by two stars is this clear okay now i should be increment by one but how many times do we need to repeat remember since the counter is starting with one so i need to go all the way up to n if n is five then one two three four five right so for that purpose i've written less than or equal to right 
now the question is how many pieces do I need to print and can I find any relationship between n and i can I generate an expression right the total number of characters to be printed is 2 into n right so 2 into n is total number of characters to be printed out of that okay i number of characters is already printed here i number of characters is already printed here so i need to just minus how many characters i need to reduce 2 into i because 1 i okay number of stars will be printed before 1 okay i number of stars will be printed at the end right after printing each line i just need to print a new line okay that's it clear let's try to compile and run the program the program name is pattern underscore hollow underscore half diamond let me try to compile this and then i like to run fine okay i would like to run with much larger value perfect <coughs> okay now we basically uh, did the bottom portion of it bottom po portion of the diamond now if you want to do the uh, upper portion it's just the reverse it's just the reverse you print this first then this then this and then this right so if you just want to print the upper portion right you just control this in such a way that you basically print starting with last line to first line and every other logic remains the same so first time how many stars you need to print n stars and obviously okay n stars are the first portion and the last portion out here first and then here 2 into n minus remember the first iteration i value same as n right so 2 into i where an n value and i value same okay so 2 into n minus 2 into i will be 0 but second time i gets decremented clear this is for the upper portion and this is for the lower portion if you only want the upper portion this one is sufficient and if you want to have the upper and lower then just retain both right now let me try to compile this and execute this let me try to compile this program okay i would like to run this program getting it okay let me just see here yeah, looks fine guys okay quite a simple if you only want the upper portion then just disable this part disable this part right you can just use a comment or normal way to disable the code as conditional in right or you can also use a regular comment right so we started by doing the bottom portion then we wrote the upper portion and then when you have both the upper portion and the bottom portion then we get the entire hollow diamond fine this is the code Right? Thank you.